Hi, welcome to my first unboxing video. Um, I just got this box today in the mail, and I believe it is my Transformers Generation 1 Matrix of Leadership box set. This is the box set with all the episodes. Um, I've been uh, anxiously awaiting this box set. I pre-ordered it uh, at the end of May, and uh, I previously owned the Rhino DVD releases uh, that came out several years ago and had since been long out of print. And I actually ended up selling those and broke even with the cost to pre-order the new set. Um, all right, let's uh, go ahead and take a look and see what's inside the box. Okay, here's the packing material. All kinds of paper. Here's the, there we go. Look at that beautiful box set. I really like the packaging on this. Um, I don't know if it'll fit on my DVD shelf though. I'll have to find somewhere else a little nicer to put it. But it comes shrink wrapped. Um, let's go ahead and pull that off. Okay, so there's the shrink wrap off. Uh, it's got a little cardboard piece here. It just comes off, that talks about the set. Okay, and let's see if I've got the touch and can open the matrix. There we go, so it just slides open like so. And then this middle piece comes up. We've got a drawing of Optimus Prime. It's uh, kind of shiny. I don't know if you can see that very well. There it is. And then we've got, on top is the booklet. Uh, Gives you a synopsis of each episode in the series. Uh, has a glossy finish on it. It feels really nice. Uh, we got an advertisement for the G.I. Joe box set, which also comes out later this year. And these are the magnets. You get an Autobot and a Decepticon magnet. I believe the Autobot came with the... Uh, Season one box set too that came out a few weeks ago, but I'm not positive. I think these are the same ones. Okay. And then here's the individual boxes for the DVD sets. So we've got Optimus Prime on this one. These are the first four discs. So the case is just fold out. So you've got four discs in each case. Let's see, there's Megatron on this one, which this is discs five, five through eight. This one we've got Galvatron, and these are discs 13 through, the last disc I see here is, it's probably 15 or 16. So that would be near the end of the series, where it features Galvatron anyway. And then we've got this one that has Rodimus Prime. And these are discs 9 through 12, it looks like. So it looks like a very nice uh, presentation. Uh, the only thing I personally don't like are the plastic, when they use plastic here on the cases, because these seem to be brittle and can break if you're not careful with them, um, which I actually had. Uh, that happened to one of the cases on my Rhino sets. Um, but overall, very good presentation. Um, I'll have to start digging in and uh, checking out the special features and see how the episode quality is. Um, the one thing that I really wanted over the Rhino set is the Rhino one, they added uh, sound effects to the uh, episodes on their 5.1 mix, and then they also had a stereo mix, which was supposed to have the original audio, 
but on some of their discs, they actually had the added sound effects on the stereo track as well. And so that was really annoying because I wanted uh, something close to what I saw as a kid. Um, the other thing too is um, there were a lot of extra animation errors that uh, Rhino didn't take the time to fix and these are supposed to be fixed but um, there were animation errors when the show was originally broadcast and so they tried to leave those alone so that uh, it should match what was broadcast but I know a lot of fans are that I've seen on the uh, Shout Factory forums have talked about uh, errors, but they don't realize that those errors were actually in the broadcast version too. Um, so anyway, it'll be fun to sit down and uh, watch these over the next few days. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed my first unboxing. I would highly recommend this set for uh, any Transformer fan that wants to drop the money right now and, uh, and pick it up. Thanks for watching. Bye.